was it like working with Mary? Did you end up actually speaking with her? Mm -hmm. I talk to her, she, she real cool, man. Like when she's on set and it's time to work, like she zoned in, like it's not okay. no key key like afterwards. Cause like at first when, like I just left her alone, I'm like she in a zone, right? So I just kind of like spoke and just stayed my, stayed out of the way, like, you know what I'm saying? And, but afterwards, like when I rapped, she like came and came talk to me, like, and just really ran it with me. And uh, now nah, she real cool, man. She real cool. A lot of the actors and actresses I didn't met, like solid. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. Okay. Like Body Cam or Mary J. Blige. Like, I shot that five years I ago. I think that's what it was. When I'm in this corner store right. stuff like that. Yeah, and the crazy part, that how that happened, like, that's when I first got back into acting. Mm -hmm. Like, got I got that role, right? So, the guy who was in the, sh in, in the movie with me, his name is Ray Nell. He's, mm -hmm. he, he, he from out the project, too. Like, okay. So, when I was in California, the movie Barbershop came on with mm -hmm. Nikki. So mm -hmm. he's the guy who was getting his hair braided. Oh, okay. So the same way, like that accent. So, you know, everybody talking and he started talking. I'm like, this dude sound like he from the city. Mm -hmm. And uh, I wound up moving back to New Orleans. I'm by my mom's house and uh, the movie come on. And I say, "Ma, don't that dude sound like he from New Orleans? She like, yeah, that's right now. I'm like, you know him? She like, yeah, he out the project. That's your your Uncle Bruce guy's son. I'm mm -hmm. like, that's crazy. So right then and there, cause I stayed out of acting for like six years when I was up there with No Limit. Right. So I kind of just dedicated my everything to music, to music. At, that, at that moment. But when I came back, I'm like, man, I want to get back into acting once I saw him. Mm -hmm. So it kind of like motivated me. So I called my agent and uh, who was my agent at the time, uh, she wound up getting out the business. So she like, look, I'm gonna introduce you to this other lady, you know what I'm saying? Who's my my my, my agent now, Miss Lisa Fuller. So, she like, yeah, I know who you are. Go on your actors access. Put me as your representation. Now I haven't been on here in six years. <laughs> so I had to call them, get my password. So I get on it. Five minutes before I got on, I had an audition. I didn't get an audition before that. No. In that whole six years, I had an audition for that movie. Wow. Right? I get the audition, I audition for it, I get the part. And you didn't know Mary J was gonna be in there no. at all. Because you know you don't never really wow. know because they don't have they just have the character name. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like and uh, like I didn't know he was in it, mm -hmm. so he wound up being in it. So he he was my friend, and in that. that's crazy. And I got on set, and I'm like, man, I just just saw like, you, right? Like you, the reason why I got back into <laughs> acting. I'm like, man, look, we gonna you know, and I chopped it up and told him why. Well, he's like, oh yeah, man, we family. So I'm like, bro, we gonna do this shit for the hood. Like we gonna we just gonna do movies together, and right. it kind of like it worked out in the universe because we had like like four movies together. Mm -hmm. And never went on 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 set together. Uh, went to the auditions like it just randomly happened. Mm -hmm. And we yeah we did did a few movies. He was in Sacrifice with me. He was uh he's in uh, Blue Bayou with me. Body Cam. Uh, and I want to say it's a it's, it's another film, but no, in Mona Lisa. In the how was it? But how was it like working with Mary? Did you end up actually speaking with her? Mm -hmm. I talk to her, she, she real cool, man. Like when she's on set and it's time to work, like she zoned in, like it's not okay. no key key like afterwards. Cause like at first when, like I just left her alone. Cause you tried like, to she stay in zone, right? So I just kind of like spoke and just stayed my, stayed out of the way. Like, you know what I'm saying? And, but afterwards, like when I rapped, she like came and came talk to me, like, and just really ran it with me. And uh, now nah, she real cool, man. She real cool. A lot of the actors and actresses I didn't met, like, Solid, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Like I didn't, I didn't miss some legends. Like when I was on Sacrifice, I was on there with the the original Chef. You know what oh, I'm saying? Wow. You know, I'm oh wow! How I yeah. yeah. But, and he sat down with me. He a fellow cancer. Like, what oh. did he give you that? Um, because you know they always like to share like, right. you know, tips and stuff. Tell me something he he told you. Keep going. That's it. Yeah, he gave me the the the, the inspiration I needed. And told me I'm doing a good job. And keep going. Keep going. And you know what I'm saying? And that's what sticks with me. It's like if I got this person here, been doing this for so long, and you know what I'm saying, a vet in the game and telling me I'm doing what I'm supposed to be doing and just keep going. It's like I right, bet. Like I got this question because you know, Mary, because since you've worked with her and since you're in acting, you know how when you start doing a certain character, certain um Feel. Right. Now, when you're watching movies, it's like a totally different experience when you're right, watching right, movies because right. you're looking at every little thing. Right, right. You know? right. So now you're seeing Mary in Ghost. Mm -hmm. Have you watched that? Do you yeah, be watching yeah, yeah. it? Yeah, yeah, I'm a fan of it. 
um, because I remember when she first came out, everybody was criticizing her. Actually, everybody knew her as Mary J, the singer. You know, right. nobody's knowing her as this actress. So a lot of but people she was, did movies before, but not right? like because everybody's tuning into Ghost. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? So when they see her doing that, everybody. I remember you know reading comments and stuff right, like right, that. Right, right, right. And some people were like, oh, I love her. You know, her acting skills. And some people right. like, oh that role and she's you know playing hard but she's not really and they can't see her like this so it's, i'm just what do you think about I how think she killed that. i think yeah i think she killed that like, i do personally because they so used to seeing her in this singer mode like in just these hurt songs or this <laughs> so they seeing in this gangster atmosphere and this like i feel like she killed it like, yeah honestly she killed it wow I Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gon' talk.